What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? I hope you're having a fantastic day. Two questions, two stories. Let's go. Our first story of the day is a reminder. If you're buying the Galaxy S23, 23 Plus or 23 Ultra, remember this does not come inside the box. It hasn't for the last couple years now and it's continuing on and there's no charging brick inside the box. So you will get the phone and you'll get a USB-C to USB-C cable, but you won't get a charging brick. I don't have, oh no, no, I don't have one near me. But charge, you know what a charging brick, you know the thing you plug the, 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 the USB-C cable in and plug it into the wall. It doesn't come with that, so make sure you at least have one. If you're new to the Galaxy line, you probably still could use your iPhone charger, especially if it's one of the newer ones because it'll have USB-C on one end, but you might want to end up getting a faster one. Um, so at least if you're getting the S23 Plus or 23 Ultra, get the, why not max it out? Get the 45 watt charger from Samsung or, or somebody else that sells a 45 watt charger, or at the very least, get the 25 watt charger. Um, so yeah, that's my thoughts. Are you gonna get one? Do you have one? Let me know. Next up, it's the same guy that has the Galaxy S23 Ultra and he did another comparison, front-facing cameras, Pixel 7 Pro versus the Galaxy S23 Ultra. And when we look at these photos, to me, definitely, I will admit, the S23 Ultra looks better. It looks clearer, sharper, it looks better. Pixel 7 looks a little washed out, a little soft, but, I don't think that's indicative of a pixel photo. I, I always get pixel photos. And I'm like, damn, that is super sharp and good looking. So I don't know. It just doesn't look that great, but I will definitely compare the cameras next to each other when I get them and see which ones that we end up liking better. And plus it's like, you can't even, the other thing is, is like just looking at the photos, it's almost like you went into a different light. Cause when you look at them, it's like you can see the, the, the bush a lot more in the Samsung photo and you can't in the other one. So it's almost like he switched position slightly and maybe that affected the quality of the photo because as you know the more light the better the photo so i don't know what do you guys think which one looks better and why do you think it looks better but it's still it's good to see this with an s23 ultra phone because obviously you want to take really nice photos and this is showing that it takes really really nice photos your question of the day is which phone do you think most people are going to like as their best phone for photos for s uh, for 2023 let me know in the comments down below do you think s23 ultra was going to win the iphone the pixel if i had a guess i would say it's either going to be the iphone or the pixel that wins again for 2023 but let me know your thoughts in the comments down below without further ado let's jump into our q a Casey's asking, what do you think my Z Fold 3 will be worth if I traded it in for the Fold 5? My internal display cracked down the hinge and I haven't fixed it yet. And then there's a small crack chip at the top right of the outer display. So if it's cracked and you're going for the Z Fold 5, most likely it's probably gonna be, I don't know, cause sometimes they surprise you like, hey, you didn't get, it has a crack, whatever, we'll pay the same amount. I would guess it's probably gonna be, for 500 at the most is my guess if it's cracked. If you get it fixed, the most I think it'll be is probably like 700 bucks. Um, but yeah, I can't, I, somewhere between three and 500 bucks would be my guess if you don't get it fixed. And Kelsey Raid is saying, I have a serious question. I have a Pixel 3, and I'm not sure if I should upgrade to the 22 Ultra or 23 Ultra. Without a doubt, get the 23 Ultra. 23 Ultra will be a better phone. Now, I'm not, when I've, I've done some videos where I'm saying, you know, don't upgrade or do upgrade. The S23 Ultra will be the best phone Samsung spec-wise puts out all year long. So if you want the best that they have to offer, get the 23 Ultra. And price-wise, a few, couple hundred bucks at that point, I would say still get the S23 Ultra over the 22 Ultra if you're jumping into this brand new. Thanks for your questions. If you have a question, leave it in the comments down below. Have a great day and we'll see you down the road. Peace.